Hey, 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 it's Lisa, Falsified and Female. I wanted to show you this wonderful big round stone here that I found over in Durango. It's so cool, isn't it? I mean, I think it's amazing. It kind of looks like a cannonball or something. It's raining like crazy here today. It's the 23rd of August, 2023, but we're not flooding yet. And I just wanted to show you a few of these cool looking uh, stones, rocks that I found quickly, maybe 10 minutes, 15 tops, so I can upload it quickly. Hope you're doing well. That's just highly interesting, isn't it? It looks like it was made that way. So like a tool or what do you think? Oh, my glasses are fogging up. Ugh. It is just, I just got through doing a workout in my exercise with me uh, channel, and I'm just sweating, so my glasses are fogging up. <laughs> I wanted to say hi to Car Carissa if she's watching this. I've been meaning to, and I keep forgetting thought plots. Those dang chem trails are just screwing her brains up. This is really nice. It's um, green. This one looks like it could have been, you know, something that was once alive, fossilized, or I guess it could be a tool. It looks more like something fossilized. Because I don't really see really any wear on it anywhere. But it does kind of look like it could have been something alive. This one's nice. Again, it looks to me like some sort of organ, an organ from some biological, um, but I don't know. It's got nice, it's a nice orange color. See better without those foggy glasses on. This one looks like, you know, it, it was some sort of tool. <clears throat> How it looks cut there. Again, if it's not a tool, the next best thing I would think would be something that was alive and it was fossilized. Boy, it is just pouring down here. I mean, we could use it, but you know, when it's dry all the time, that's more of a chance for um, flooding. Kind of look like a foot, huh? <laughs> but it does look like it's been taken out some of the stone here. Pretty cool. I gotta sit down. My back is hurting. I'm standing here. Okay. Whew. I just love that ball. I think that's so cool. And then this. Pretty cool looking. Intriguing stuff. Do you think it is, or do you know if this is a tool, or is it a fossilized, or just a plain old stone rock? Cool. I think that is um, flint. Um, it's just wet right now because it's been outside in the rain and I just grabbed some and brought them in to show you. I thought this one was really cool looking because of the, I guess I need to figure out which, there we go. The two looking eyes, you know, just because it has a funny face there. I thought, well, that's amazing. And then if you turn it this way, there's like another looking face, the nose and the two eyes, but if you turn it this way, I think there was another, you know, so it's just an interesting stone. To me, I think it was, it used to be biologically, you know, alive it's, instead of geology, although there's sand and silt and all that stuff from the flood that formed into whatever was alive as they were smashed. This is very shiny, um, kind of looks like it could have been used as a tool but then again it could just be worn that way but I still picked it up
pretty cool looking. I'm going to make sure this is wiped off. I don't know if it's blurry because now my glasses are foggy and I can't tell if it's just my eyes are blurry or maybe I need to wipe off the camera hole. This one's cool too. It's flint. I believe it looks like flint. I'm just dripping with sweat also. <laughs> it's, like, uh, it's, it's good for you. Sweat is very, very good for you. Everybody should sweat. That's how you detoxify. I don't know if that's the light's good for you here or worse for you. Guess let me know. Because I have a light on in here so that you could see it better, but I'm not sure if it's better or worse. Whew, gotta wipe my face off, sorry. Oh, goodness. Just dripping. But I want to do a quick video. I try to do one every day, but I don't always get around to it. I've got, you know, other things going on in my other two channels and, um, but I thought, just do one real quick. Show them these, some of these cool ones that I've put in this little milk jug thing there. I, I find them, you know, very intriguing and interesting and cool looking. These are, this is just a big old piece of flint but I thought it was kind of like a bird too, you know. I, I think some of these may be some sort of biological fossilized animal that turned into flint or turned into whatever. Collagen turns into feldspar. That's what um, Mud Fossil University, Roger Spur, had discovered with his DNA tests and his experiments with what he has found. If you haven't checked him out, you should check him out. I forgot yesterday or the day before to put the link on there. Darn it! These thought clods are getting the best of me. Oh, that's nothing really. Um, I had some in here already and I threw some more in here just to carry it. So maybe we're, that looks like a little fish, don't you think? But it also kind of looks like a, a tool or something. I don't know. What do you think? Tool, biology, geology. You don't know, you don't care. <laughs> I'd love to hear from you. Just so much you think. This is not the best um, place. I, I mean, like this light don't seem to be doing it much justice, but hopefully you can see. I, this kind of looks like also it was kind of like a tool maybe. But, shoot, I don't know. That's amazing. Isn't that cool? Beautiful, like colors and stuff in it. But we got a couple more minutes, and I wanted to show you a couple more that I had brought. I think they're over. Um right over here let's see that one was pretty cool looking I thought and this one find them highly intriguing and interesting. I found this nice black heart shaped rock. Okay. This one looks like it was kind of made like that because it looks like this part was cut out. And it was used for something. But I could be wrong. I don't know. But it's very sharp. And it looks like it was made that way. Sharp, that is.
This is neither just a, hmm, what could that have been? That doesn't really look like just a rock. It looks like something that could have been alive. Like a little bird head here, maybe, and that was the beak. But, heck, could be all sorts of things. But it definitely has turned to stone, so we could consider it a rock, but I believe it's more fossilized. This is really cool, too. Um, it's like green with all these, like, white, kind of light green um, bumps on it. Or this stuff, I don't know what that is. But it's pretty cool looking anyway, don't you agree? This again to me looks like an organ, possibly a heart of something. But I'm not sure. Pretty color, it's a red. If I let my sweat drip on it, let's see, that's that's when it's wet. <laughs> And last one, before we say adios, amigos, is another flint. It doesn't, it's not that great. I just, I thought it was kind of cool. I think all flint is beautiful. It's got beautiful colors. And if you see it when it is wet, wipe it off my sweat. It, it just really shines. Um, it's got a beautiful color. But I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Thanks for joining me. And I'll see you next time on Fossil Finding Female. Bye.